What's up guys? Welcome to this Rain or Shine Golf video. Today we have a fun one. We have George Bryan, father-in-law, at the George Bryan Golf Academy, and we're gonna be helping you guys fixing your slice. I'm struggling right now. George is gonna, yeah, George, yeah, exactly. See those eyes? He knows I'm struggling right now. So George is gonna help me fix the slice, and hopefully while he's helping me fix my slice, he can help you guys along the way. We got the Mevo Plus, getting all of our data, and we're gonna dissect that data, and he's gonna give us some tips tricks to cure our slice. Let's get into it. Alright coach, break down these numbers for me if I'm looking to fix my slice. So one of the things I like to point out, it's not just numbers with the Mevo, you also get the visual reference so you get to use the variable that matters much so you can do it inside outside this is outside and you can see you playing a little bit of a slice so you got a mm -hmm. you got a problem you want to address i think you look at spin rate first so you got good speed good distance but look at your spin rate six thousand sevens that's not good that's that's high yeah then your smash factor i'd like to see at least uh, I mean, 140, in the 140, mid 140s numbers is a good start. So do something different and you see it slicing. Yep. You might start with the visual reference, thinking about it going from right to left, get the spin, da spin down. What do you do with the spin? You react with a club face and maybe close that face, figure a way to close that face. Mm. And I think you'll see if you close the face, improve the path a little bit. Yep. Right, push it out to the right, that smash factor will go up. All right, well, you got to teach me how to do that, all right? Got to do something different. All right, George, so if someone's struggling with a slice, what would the first thing you would tell them to do? Especially if they have the privilege of the ball flight with the visual reference, feedback. So do something different and do it immediately. Don't be afraid to make a major change in a hurry. So if you're looking at your data and your ball flight, so if your ball starting left, and you can easily see that on the Mevo, the, if your ball's doing this, well, think about what it's gonna be to do it drastically different. So we want it going that way. Mm. So look, so we go in here, we feel it. We rotate the form. See the hand is the face. So we go here to here. The slice is this way. The slice is going, is going out to in, we want to go drastically different. So we go, instead of doing it here to here, we want to go here to here. Mm, that's good. What do you call that? Drive in? Yeah, I like, I like to call it, I, and I picked this up a long time ago from David Ledbetter. I call that driving, mm. driving. I like to turn it upside down and this right arm as you come through, turn it upside down. If you're left-handed, just the opposite. And the left arm, you're gonna turn it, I call that sunny side up. That's <laughs> old Mo Norman, sunny side up. All right, I obviously need to work on some things. And the beauty of being at the George Bryan Golf Academy, I can get some reps in of curing my slice inside. In here. At the GBGA, we got two hitting bays where I can really work on perfecting my club path. All right, after all these drills, I think I'm ready to take it on. I think I'm ready not to hit a slice. Let's see what the Mevo says and see if I can do it. George, I think you fixed me. Tell me what these numbers mean now. Well, first of all, you fixed yourself. <laughs> you saw the visual reference of the Mevo Plus. I really like that too. You can see your yellow line and the, your ball's almost into itself with a slight draw. I look at the carry club speed for, and then I'll, I'll 
look look down and find the smash factor and then confirm with the spin rate and that's your your spin rate's going to be 30 from 3000 to 3600 is going to be good for you William and so I look at the visual speed I check the spin rate and the smash factor smash factor and you can see 145 plus 145 146 is really good a little less spin than the first one, right? Yep, but <laughs> <laughs> but you're fixed. Yeah, I'm fixed. You are a miracle worker. Nope, you're Thanks. the one that hit it. Thank you, sir. All right, big shout out to George for the help today. It really helped me. Hopefully it helped you guys. Make sure to smash that like button and smash that subscribe button for more videos like this. Peace.